Maltimore, you took the silver medal at the pole vault here at the World Indoor Championships. Describe how that feels for you. I'm quite happy that it's uh, that it's uh, that it was uh, silver at the end of the competition. Um, but I'm not really happy if uh, the way I jumped today um, technically wasn't really good, and uh, that's maybe why I didn't didn't make the the 85. Jumped 90 last week, and that was um, all in all a little bit of a of a of a better competition for me. But well, that's pole vault, and there was one guy jumping uh, jumping better than me today, so it's silver. You didn't have the the new very new world record holder was not there. He was, but he was here in the stadium watching you. Um, what are your thoughts of this development in the world record of the the um, pole vault? Yeah, I mean, it's an, was an was an amazing performance of him. Um, he had a great winter until he gets uh, gets injured and. Um, yeah, it will, will, if, when, he's, when he's healthy again, it will not be easy to beat him, but um, I think all of us will, will hard work for it. I think though in pole vault, um, everybody believed that Sergei Bubka's record was un, uh, untouchable. Now that someone has does it, does that give inspire all of you to, to compete harder, better, to try and beat Renault? Yeah, of course. Um, um, it, it shows that nothing is impossible in pole vault. And, uh, um, that if you work hard, if you if you do good training, that you can can really jump high and uh, higher than maybe a few years ago someone would would think. Awesome. Thank you very much. Thanks okay. For coming back.